Joe Biden. Joe Biden. Have you taken a cognitive? No, I haven't taken a test. Why the hell would I take a test? Come on, man. That's like saying you before you got in this program, you take a test where you're taking cocaine or not. What do you think? Huh? Are are you a junkie? By the way, it's my little sister, Valerie, and I'm Jill's husband. Oh, no, you switched on me. This is my wife. This is my sister. They switched on me. But I tell you, if you have a problem figuring out whether you're for me or Trump and you ain't black. There is not a single solitary reason in the world why, why, as I said, we shouldn't be in a position that everybody. And that's my wife, Jill. Hey, Jilly, I'm Jill's husband, actually. And Corn Pop was a bad dude. And he ran a bunch of bad boys. And I did. And back in those days, you show how things have changed. Play the radio. Make sure the television, excuse me, make sure you have the record player on at night. The the, the phone, make sure the kids hear words. We hold these truths to be self-evident. All men and women created by, go, you know the, you know the thing. Because if you could take care, if you were a quartermaster, you can sure in hell take care of running a, you know, a department store uh, thing, you know, where and the second floor of the ladies' department or whatever, you know what I mean? Well, I'm sick and tired of smart guys. You know, the rapidly rising uh, um, uh, in with, uh, with, uh, I don't know. uh, uh, You have been to a caucus? No, you haven't. You're a line dog face pony soldier. Why, why attack Sanders? Why, 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 why? You're getting nervous, man. What kind of country are we going to be? Mm-hmm. Four more years of George, uh, George, uh, he uh, is going to find ourselves in a position where if uh, Trump gets elected, uh, we're going to be uh, we're going to be in a different world. After lie, after lie, after lie, after lie. You know, we have to come together. That's why I'm running. I'm running as a proud Democrat. For the Senate. And by the way, you know, I sit on the stand and it get hot. I got a lot of I got hairy legs that turn that 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 that, that turn uh, um, blonde in the sun. And the kids used to come up and reach in the pool and rub my leg down. So it was straight and then watch the hair come back up again. They look at it. So I learned about roaches. I learned about kids jumping on my lap. And I've loved kids jumping on my lap. Rock and I think it's a right for people to have bad health care. We have to do at least several things. One, we have to uh, depend on what the president's going to do right now. And first of all, he has to uh, tell, uh, uh, wait till the cases before anything happens. Look, exacerbating the need for environmental, for environmental justice. Sorry, as a bug. <laughs> Folks, we got a lot of work to do. I don't even need you to get me elected. It's a case where we cannot let this, we've never allowed any crisis from the Civil War straight through to the pandemic of 17, all the way around 16. We have never, never let our democracy take second fiddle. We, they, we can both have a democracy and elections and at the same time correct the public health. Everywhere I've been hearing all around the country, you're trying your best, but it never feels like enough. It's- and here comes the train that he tried to make sure didn't continue to up front. No, that's the commuter. All right. No, that's what. But folks, look. Anyway, I am uh, I am very willing to let the American public judge my physical and mental fil- my physical as well as my mental fil- fitness. I'll lead an effective strategy to mobilize. True international effort to pressure. 